Let's take a look at Bill Cheatham, the rhythmic version. Here's measure number one. Let's take a look at measure number two. that first note in parentheses that's a phantom stroke so we're not actually going to play that we're going to miss that and that takes us on to measure number three on this first line here we're playing over a C chord and as you'll see once again we have a phantom stroke the X in parentheses on line number one We'll skip that, and again, that resulting sound will be this. Which takes us into measure number four on this line. Let's go to line number two, and you'll notice if you look closely at the tab that the first three measures of the second line are the same as the first three measures of the first line. So I'll play those for you slowly, all together. which leaves us with the fourth measure on this line. Again, we have another phantom stroke. If you're having trouble with the phantom strokes, you're not familiar with them, you should be able to figure it out just by watching, listening, and checking the tab out. Uh, but you can get some farther, further information in the 30 Days to Better Banjo course at the website at playbetterbanjo.com. All right, let's take a look at the B part. Here's the first measure of the third line. 